The footage had horrified the world. A grinning Ratko Mladic patting a young Muslim boy on the head and assuring him and other children they'd be safe just hours before allegedly overseeing the murder of 8,000 men in nearby Srebrenica. The boy in the video is now a 24-year-old man. Izudin Alic and his mother Fatima recall clearly the events of 16 years ago, the tragedy that engulfed them as well as so many others, bringing their happy family life to an abrupt and cruel end. Fatima Alic said the Bosnian Serb commander had been distributing food on the streets of Potocari, a Srebrenica suburb. I remember that he was handing out bread. My father-in-law went there and wrestled with another man over a piece of bread in order to bring it to the children. He grabbed it so that children would have something to eat. After that, he was handing out chocolate to children. Alic said he wasn't supposed to be there, but he snuck out of the family hiding place and joined other children in taking a chocolate bar from Ladic. This is a place where I was with other children when Ratko Mladic came. This is where he gave us chocolate. He asked me for my name and I told him my name is Zudin. Alic didn't know it then, but while he was enjoying his treat, Mladic's soldiers were hunting down his father's Sazet in woods nearby. His father's body was found years later in a mass grave. The family reburied him in the town's memorial center, where Alic often goes to pray, and where thousands of Mladic's victims were laid to rest. He says he was glad when the Serb commander was finally captured, and hopes Mladic gets the biggest sentence possible if he's convicted by the war crimes tribunal in The Hague. Karen Sloan, The Associated Press.